Hello viewers, in this tutorial I'll, I will be teaching you how to import different fonts into GIMP. Seeing as when you download GIMP there is a certain number of fonts and you might want to uh, have a different kind, a different sort of font that looks better for your image. So first off you want to open up your website where you download your fonts. I'll be using dafont.com because it's worked very well for me and it has a lot of fonts I think. Anyway. So just find your font. I'll just be using Seven Swordsman. It's on Celtic if you like it. So click download and you'll see it's a dot zip file. Make sure it's set on save file in this little pop up and click OK. Now save it. I'll just save it on my desktop. Save it wherever you want. Click save. So what you want to do is just go to your start menu computer and find your find where you saved the file in here it's there it is seven swordsman dot zip right click it and this is where your file manager program comes in i'll have some links in the description the video description i've been using seven zip it's worked very well for me it's a great program i'd highly recommend it so you want to right click and after you've downloaded seven zip you select that and select extract files and extract it wherever you want I'll just put it here it'll be on the desktop again click OK and a file will appear you just have to find it there it is seven swordsman underscore bb and sometimes it's just the file sometimes it's a folder I'll open up the folder and you see you'll have a couple of of files we have the font info dot text which is totally unnecessary in my opinion. You, if you open it, it's just like copyrights and things like that, freeware, the stuff like that. And then there's the the TTF file, the .ttf. This is what you need. You want to right click it and click copy. Then this is um, this is on a regular Windows Vista computer. You would go to C drive, you would go to program, you would go to Windows, fonts, and then here you see you have all the fonts on your computer, pretty much. What you want to do is, anywhere on here, you just right click and click paste you may need to provide administrator permission click continue and it'll paste it there and then next time you open GIMP I'll do that right now next time you open GIMP you will have the font for use so I'll just open GIMP up quickly might take a little while to load because you've just installed a new font so if you create a new image and take your font tool fonts tool text tool and you write your text then you go to the tool options for the text tool and you see if you click on this little symbol here you can change to your font it's here c7 swordsman bb i'm just going to raise the size so you can see it a bit and there you go, your different font. Subscribe if you like this video and thanks for watching.